watching a TV program called The Texas Bucket List. Kind of a strange program, but this guy travels around Texas looking for things to see or do or eat or things of that sort before he kicks the bucket. And uh, he ran onto this restaurant down someplace in Texas called a Wild Hog Restaurant. Or the Wild Hog Barbecue, rather. And uh, they feature barbecued wild hogs. Now, Texas has millions of wild hogs. They, they're overrun by them. In fact, they have so many of the they try to get people to come there to hunt them. You don't even need a hunting license to hunt wild hogs in Texas. And uh, in fact, it's getting to the point where there's almost as many uh, cooked pigs for Christmas and Thanksgiving as there are turkeys. But the uh, the Wild Hog Barbecue, they sell all the usual things like ribs and uh, chops and things of that sort, but their featured article is a Wild Hog Taco. And they sell hundreds of those and uh, uh, they're so easy to make and everything, so I decided to make a wild hog taco for dinner tonight and do that as my video. Well, Ethel's here and she got everything ready for me. I didn't have to fix anything. She fixed the uh, the uh, pork here and the coleslaw and the beans and all of that. And you want to start out with a flour tortilla. And you warm it and you start here and the first thing you want to do is put in a layer of beans and any kind of beans will work whatever you have this is uh, actually ranch style beans here put those in and this is Pull pork. Now, it's it's really easy to make, and it's the cheapest pork that you can buy. You buy a pork shoulder, or pork butt. Cook it about ten to twelve hours in that slow cooker, and get some barbecue sauce on it, and it is delicious. And finally, on top of that, coleslaw. Now you can make a salad if you want to, but coleslaw works so well. And then you can add some garnish. I've got some olives here. Stick on one or two or three of those and and there is the wild hog taco. And I'm gonna eat this sucker and see what I think of it. Mm, mm, 
it's good. That is good stuff. I may, may have to make me another one after this, but I'm going to finish this. And, you know, this would be a, <clears throat> a great way if you're going to have a cookout. Just make a bunch of them and just set it out and let everybody make their own tacos. In the meantime, I'm going to finish this. And all I can say is, God bless America, God bless Texas. And where did you ever find a sign like this? And by the way, if it offends you, suck it up, buttercup. You're going to be offended a lot of times in Texas. Bye.